My name is Katie Mers. I'm from Brooklyn. I studied art at Cooper Union, and I've done a lot of different kinds of work, internal, tiny, cartoony, and my work right now is a culmination of everything I've done in a very simple form on a black void space with white writing. And you know, I, I think it's a, a bold move on part of the college to commission this in a time when everything is negative and kind of spinning backwards. This is spinning forward into something and it's generating life. In here, I feel like I'm collecting various points in time. And then I just, well, Zach isn't up yet, but like, I feel like it's a collect pond of stuff I'm experiencing and learning about the college in a really natural way. And then things from the interviews. And then the kids have been great. I mean, every class that comes here, I sort of ask for icons. The theater class had like all these objects I wouldn't think of, like pulleys and lights and curtain. And then the dance students had like feet, legs, and they were making symbols of what a mask would be with a question mark next to it. So they've been giving me a lot of, of their stuff to work with. It's not half and half even, it's just like a big wheel cut out and all the, there's different sections of the past, the present, the future, and two months ago, three months ago, and then my symbols that mean something that I don't think anybody can read. <laughs> it's like a time capsule in a way. It's like a spiral time capsule. Like for me, it's a time capsule for anyone that's here now. You know, it's, it's just like this m monument to this moment at her sinus, the United States, in the centuries. A lot of my pieces are a reflection of a moment in time of what's going on in my mind. So I've put the information and the people that I've taken in and this smokestack is a reflection of my mind processing the experiences and the dialogues that I've had at that moment. So in a way, it's um, the inside of my mind or one's mind, like mag magnetized onto the outside of the smokestack. It's an essay about Ursinus in September 2020.